Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Creeper World 4. Yes, we are back. We are going back to the colonies and we are going for this auto build FPS 6. Uh, I've not played it. Uh, as you can see, I haven't loaded it for once. Uh, generally, I try to load things, but I have not this time. And here we go. We have custom keys, which is keypad zero, which is auto fire. Enter first person, which is the mode itself. Show special terrain. That will be anti-creeper and creeper breeders and things like that. Uh, weapon effectiveness. That is how that. And we have an upgrade panel, so we will want to be getting our upgrade. So it looks like we're here. Uh, we're going to be needing to do this and let us enter. As you can see, we are first person. Uh, we want to toggle uh, the auto fire uh, as soon as possible. <laughs> there we go. And we want to start building. Now, we don't want to expand too fast usually uh, because, again, it is building for us. So we want our generation to last. We want to build these towers, build our defenses, but we don't want to lose anything. As you can see, I'm already losing some stuff uh, because I'm focusing everywhere. Now we have multiple weapons. We have a mortar. Not too useful as of right now. We have anti-creeper as well. So we can actually fill up lands with anti-creeper. It is good to have. Not as effective as just the cannon blast. Uh, as you can see, the cannon does handle things better. But for instance, if we go here, we mortar that a little bit and pop down some anti-creeper, that should actually start breeding for us. Uh, and one of our goals is to get to these points of interest. Uh, these will give us, I guess, talent points in this one. Uh, sometimes it's just raw power, sometimes it's talent points. I believe this one was talent points, as it said custom before it was that. We got an upgrade point, and we got a tower. So generally, when you see a tower, you want to make sure towers get built. Uh, and as you can see, we're so this is actually a pretty easy start comparatively to... Oh, oh, no, get the tower, get that tower. I want to get my up upgrade point, but I want this tower to build first, because it'll sort of hold in this area. Um, we are at a huge deficit, because we are building this entire area at once now. Uh, so that is the problem. Uh, and it's because we took this. Because we took that... Uh, we're actually able to really, really expand. But because we're able to expand, you can see our base is not the most energy efficient. Perfectly fine, perfectly fine, but yeah, we will get there. Again, this is placing a lot of towers. I do like that thought. This cannon has been built, but it doesn't have power because we're in such a deficit. So let's just switch to the anti-creeper and just try and protect this area a bit. Uh, I let that tower fall. It's not going to fall anymore because we have our anti-creeper wall in the way. And we should be... Oops, let's protect that with the cannon. Uh, and let these, again, get caught up. How is the other side doing? Uh, looks like it's doing pretty okay. Uh, we're pretty good over here. Let's check out this upgrade thing. Um, I believe we may have to pause for the upgrade window. So what do we have? We have auto spray, and this is uh, a small amount of AC will be continually generated by the player. All right, yeah, let's, let's go for that. Uh, it looks like uh, we can actually change what we do choose. So we have a whole slew of options. Um, we have a shield, we have auto range, uh, aura range. We have an aura, apparently, nearby urn. Buildings close will have an urn effect, which is fantastic. Uh, buildings nearby will slowly complete. Oh, yes. <laughs> there we go. And we'll have an aura. So, there we go. Uh, we have chosen our, uh, our necessary agree our improvements. Uh, so now we will be building things, uh, when we are close, and we will give them an aura. Uh, it doesn't quite look like they have the urn effect, but us just being near them, so you can see this is firing just because we are near. So, yeah, that's pretty amazing. I already like it. Uh, huge improvements over uh, anything else. And I haven't really decided. Am I going even the right way? Do I want to be going this way? There is a power uh, upgrade point over there. So we probably should work towards getting that. Let's actually exit uh, first person mode and take... A oh, actually, let's get this tower first. And this should help build it because we are nearby... Uh, so theoretically this should build faster. Doesn't quite look like it. Oh, we also have a bit- I forgot! They did add in later ones, you have a build gun. A gun that lets you build. So fantastic. <laughs> 
build gun. Uh, we have all sorts of utility to our name. So look, if we turn to our build gun, we can see that is actually building from our gun. And there we go, we filled it with ammo. It's pretty solid. Just like us right now. So we're gonna sort of cut off the creep right here. Again, build up the defenses. We'll check the lay of the land in a second. We wanna get this actually, there's an upgrade point right over here. Might as well be taking that and we'll take this uh, breeder as well. And we'll use it from there. That's where we'll sort of make our first decision on where we wanna go. So let's make sure this cannon gets built. Give it some ammo. Fantastic, it can start defending. Uh, I can see anti-creep everywhere and we are getting close. Let's, oh, let's use some anti-creep on the crimson. Again, crimson is weak to anti-creep, so of course that's what you want to be doing. Uh, but I really want this upgrade point. I also want to cut off the creep from the left side, because if there's no creep coming in... All right, let's get some mortaring. Looks like our mortar is doing some decent work. Uh, that should help cut it down, uh, and then we can sort of clean up the rest. Clean it, clean it, clean it. Ooh, there's a lot. A lot of crimson coming, though. And that's the problem. <laughs> this crimson is not doing us very kindly indeed. So hopefully we can sort of take over this breeder section, make it ours, and that as well will help pretty, pretty substantially. Because the more breeder we have versus the breeder that they have, the better for us, of course. Uh, we can see we're taking an upgrade point. Uh, should be taking any moment now. And there, ooh, that was not. Uh, Decrimsonifier. It will reduce the amount of crimson in Creeper close to the player. Okay, okay. So that wasn't an upgrade point. That was we passively destroy Creeper around us, it looks like. Um, so I guess that is to help with this side. So I will happily take that. Uh, again, we want to just really get the anti-creeper here. And I want to just make... Oh, look at that. Oh, see? Just me getting close literally cleanses the uh, the crimson. That's pretty incredible. Uh, a little a little awkwardly powerful because, you know, we have the anti-creeper gun. So us just existing, removing the crimson sort of negates the need as much for the anti-creeper gun. But I'm not gonna I'm not gonna say no to that. So let's uh, let's take a look at the sky and see what the map is like. Uh, we have this whole area. There is oh there's some breed over there. So maybe we should go to the other side as well and take this uh, and start to work our way around. Although we can just cut it off here. Ooh that would be pretty good. Yeah let's just cut it off here and then we'll work on this side as well. Uh, it looks like this is the ultimate goal, and we want to take out the outsides, so pretty fantastic there. Not going to complain. So where was it? We want to cut this off. This is where we want to be. Uh, and let's use some mortars and just blow a chunk out in between, uh, and hopefully we can get this shield activated. Uh, we do have some... We probably have some talent points. I believe you get talent points over time. So that is a pretty beautiful, beautiful thing. Uh, so having some talent points, I will be very happy with that as well. But let's let's first, uh, you know, again, cleanse the area. I don't want I don't want to pause too much. Um, looks like we got this mortar on mine. All right, let's do a quick pause. Let's check our talent situation. We do have one. So we have an evaporation aura, which will evaporate nearby creeper. Done. Pushes back creeper in an aura. Yeah, let's get the shield when we can. Can't right now. Perfectly fine. Unpause. But now we have this evaporation aura. So our aura will just slowly destroy creep around us. Again, it seems very, very powerful. Let's see if it will keep this area clear. And if it does, then... Then yeah, we're, we're really, really good. Let's also try and get this breeder. Again, creeper breeder is... Oh, it did not keep it clear. Perfectly fine. Perfectly fine. Uh, just was trying something out. And let's see if we can get some anti-creeper in there. Uh, again, uh, if we... Nah, that's, that's too deep. But we should be able to take this area over. It doesn't really look like there's any real spawners over there, so we do want this section to be ours. 
Uh, again, we are pushing things back. We're taking it over. More cannons. Yes, let's just build this as fast as humanly possible. And you can get up there, Mr. Cannon. You are ours to command. Uh, and again, look at this. Watch this. We're just going to walk, and boom. It's all going to turn into regular creeper, which will help our guns, help everything, and we're just going to keep pushing it back. Uh, the ability to just cleanse the... Uh, Cleanse the crimson. Uh, I I find hilarious and amazing. So so yeah, I, I'm pretty happy with that. I'm not gonna complain. What do we have? What do we get? Is it just a talent point? I'll be happy with the talent point. Uh, looks like we did get an upgrade point. Let us pause and use it for the shield. Boom. Uh, all right. Aura range is to increase the range of auras. Fantastic. And we can get air. Oh look at that. Uh, cannon area, weapon efficiency, all of those good things. We do want to get those, but I really like this aura system that they got going on. So yeah, I'm gonna, I'm just gonna keep going with that. We need two points for the next one, however. So yeah, it'll be, it'll be a hot second. Uh, you know, not too bad. Again, we have taken over this. Look at this. Oh, it does appear that I have hit something to uh, eliminate the sound. I don't know what. Uh, what did I do? Uh, let's see, settings, sound, there we go. I, I don't know what the mute button is, but apparently I hit it. Maybe it's M, but I don't know. I hit something, probably on the keypad somewhere. Uh, but what is producing the creep over here? That, it, it's this emitter. There we go. We need to get this emitter. This emitter is our primary, primary target. We're just gonna, we're just gonna destroy it. We're going straight for it. We're gonna build this mortar. We're gonna build this uh, cannon. I covered them in anti-creep first, and then I was building them. That way they are safe while I build. And look at this. We are destroying the everything. Destroying the everything. Oh, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. I want that upgrade point, assuming it's an upgrade point. I don't quite know. But you can just see, we are just marching along. We have the shield. We're pushing back the creep. Uh, we're not caring too, too much about the area behind us. Again, just a wee bit of anti creep just to allow them to make sure they're surviving while we're shooting them. And then we are going to keep moving. I want this emitter. This emitter is the goal. So, it's so it's just so weird. It's such a different play style, and yet it's the exact same play style. They do... The, the map creators of this game do incredible, incredible, incredible things. And yeah, we need to stay over here because it looks like the Crimson just is spawning. Uh, I don't see any Crimson generator, which is very strange. Usually there's a crystal or something along those lines, but it just appears to be emanating. Uh, I don't even see it on, under the ground. So let's just, yeah, it, it just exists. So we really need to focus this area. Uh, Mr. Tower, you are a life sam uh, savior. Savior, Mr. Tower. Help us. Uh, I don't know if I have enough oomph, so to speak. Oh, but look at that. Okay, this. All right, we're gonna we're gonna anti creep up. Whoop, 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 whoop. Big pile of anti creep. Big shots. Let's get this nullifier online as fast as possible. Oh, we got... Oh, no! <laughs> we got skimmed literally, literally as we got the nullifier online. But the nullifier is online. It has power. And that is going to basically destroy this area entirely. We have one. Oh, look. Ah, uh, see? There's a creeper. There's a... Not creeper, uh, but a... Uh, oh, my God. Terminology. Crimson. Crimson generator underneath it. Okay, so that makes all the sense in the world. And look at how fast this cleans up now that we've turned off that emitter. I don't know how big that emitter was, but it doesn't matter anymore. We have taken the Landia. It is ours. It looks like we're going to get two upgrade points from this, unless we get some special upgrade. Uh, I'll take a special upgrade. I like special upgrades. Oh, oh, I can't shoot them. I don't have a sniper. Oh, no. Oh, no. I saw them. Oh, my friends. Uh, there's still some creeper generation. We're going to take this. It's going to be ours. Let's just mortar it a little bit. Mortar the big waves. Get out of here, big waves. We don't need you. Get out of the corner. That's right. 
That's right. Get out of here. And fill it with anti-creeper. And this is ours. No creep generation on this side. Uh, we're gonna very quickly just, again, power up this nullifier. I don't want any blobs to sort of disrupt this whatsoever. So boop, 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 boop. And we're good. You done, blobs. And let us get this upgrade point as well. So it looks like we have taken a Taken aside, I'm very happy with that. Uh, it has been, uh, oh wait, I think I need to stay near it uh, in order to get it, and an upgrade point. Perfect, perfect. Pause, four, and now we have three. So we will upgrade the aura effects for the cannon. Done and done. And uh, upgrade the order effects for the mortar. That will cost two. Okay, we do not yet have that. So let us unpause and get back to the action. This is pushing in naturally. Uh, so we do want to move to the other side, and I will be moving to the other side, but there's a point literally right here. So yeah, let's let's just get this point. Get this uh, anti-creeper breeder and see what we can do from there. Now uh, we're going to move in, try and build some stuff if we can. Uh, boom, boom, go mortar. You do all the mortar things. Upgrade point, fantastic. That I think is what we needed for the upgrade point for the mortar. But let's see if we can just get enough here to hold this. Because uh, let's just turn on some anti creep. Fantastic. And I think we should be able to hold. I think this will be enough once everything is built. Uh, looks like things have gotten built. We are getting the breeder going on. So let's actually shift sides to this over here. We should actually be overpowered for the beginning, which is fantastic. As you can see, look at us just destroy this basic creeper over here. Again, we have upgrade points that we can spend, uh, and I am looking forward to spending. Uh, but first things first, let us just make sure we get this breeder breeding for us right there, and let's power these up. Power, 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 power. Almost got destroyed, but we powered it to full. Fantastic. Quick pause, quick four, quick spend on that. Done and done. Unpause. And just that easy. We can go on a faster speed, but again, uh, we're actually destroying stuff pretty quickly. It doesn't really make too much of a difference if it's on a faster speed. And yeah, I, I think we've gotten some pretty solid power. I mean, I actually feel very powerful in this mode already. Most of the game, most of the first person shooters, I've done about three of them in the past. Uh, you start off very, very, very weak. And it stays that way for quite a while. I mean, I'm not gonna lie. It, it really feels like you're weak for an extended period of time. Um, but in this one, it, it feels like we got pretty powerful pretty quick. Uh, and we have another half of the map that we're gonna be able to clear and take and things right now. So... So yeah, I'm feeling pretty good. Uh, let us see. Ooh, okay, 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 okay. Uh, let's actually just work with this in a line, so let's just do a big cutoff. Let's do some more- oh, look at those mortar blasts! Oh, that mortar upgrade that we just got, which was uh, increasing the aura of the mortar. I don't know how much that affects the actual impact range, because I know there are actual weapon upgrades. But that did appear to do some pretty good work. Uh, I will take it. We could have just pushed straight for the center. Uh, but that sort of, it doesn't defeat the purpose of the map. I think you do want to get as powerful as you can before you take on the center of the map. So that is where we are working. Again, just having fun, just relaxing, just chilling. Um, I will say I've been doing a lot of random different games. I've been actually getting back into Resident Evil 8 lately, which is a whole lot of fun. I'm currently working on the knife-only challenge in Resident Evil 8. Uh, it's pretty wild. Uh, definitely, you know, doing it on casual. Not, not. It's not too much of a challenge, honestly. Uh, and yeah, it's it's really good fun. So. So yeah, I mean, it's good to go back to some of your older games and things like that, see how they still fare, uh, and I'm very much looking forward to the DLC of Resident Evil 8 coming out, uh, well, in a while. <laughs> you know, it, it's, I think it's October, uh, or something like that, um, so surprise, surprise, it's gonna be a little while, but 
you know, these things come, these things go. We're still taking things. Again, every time we see a nice little hub, we are going to just try and build them up. So we are building up this cannon, building up this mortar. Uh, please, Mr. Mortar, there we go. And we have built it. Uh, we can do some overarching work. Maybe I will just try and get rid of some of these really big peaks. Uh, this does help overall. Uh, as you can see, look at the amount of destruction we're able to lay down from a distance. Uh, ooh, there's some really... Ooh, all right, so that's too far. That's as far as we can go. Perfectly fine. But look, we, we've really, really just thinned out the group. I probably should have done this before. Wasn't quite thinking. Was just sort of chilling with going with the flow. Uh, but, yeah, look at this. I mean, oh, now we can just take our, our uh, cannon and just mop up. Oh, let's actually more of this too. Boom, boom. Oh my gosh, it does so much damage. Uh, and, and I say damage, I mean, I guess it's not. Yeah, I mean, it is, but it isn't. It's it's weird because it's creeper damage uh, and we just cleanse this entire area. We have so much generation that we can take huge swaths of land too. That is a huge, huge portion. Oh, uh, an auto defender automatically snipes. Oh, we have an auto snipe. That is huge. That's awesome. I haven't seen that in any first person shooter. We are now a walking sniper tar uh, sniper. That's awesome. I probably should have gone to this side first thinking about it. Would've it would have saved me some some headache on the other side, but let's get this sorted. So going to this side was definitely, definitely, definitely worth it. We want to be able to auto snipe things and we need this cannon. Hopefully, with this point, we'll be able to get a new thing. This will probably be the uh, area upgrade or aura upgrade for the uh, sprayer. Yeah, the sprayer attachment. So that'll be good. Uh, don't really care too much about it. Probably should go just for power itself. But, you know, where's the fun in that? We want all the auras. Uh, very cool thing about this power thing is it powers even the sprayers. So even though they take anti-creep, look at that. We powered the sprayer up. I mean, I'm not building this this huge swath of anti-creep. That was the sprayer itself. Um, so yeah, let us get down and dirty. Uh, looks like, oh god, we even got this tower on. Oh jeez, everything is just going our way right now. Uh, I really want to get to this emitter just like I did on the other side, but as you can see, it's just a little bit, a little bit of creep in our way. Just a little, little bit. Um, uh, we did activate all of the towers, apparently, which was an objective, so fantastic. And we have to collect all of the items that is required. So I didn't even look at the requirements. Usually collecting the items is, uh, I guess maybe it's required? I don't know. I mean, it seems like it should be optional. If you don't need to collect all the items, then, hey, good on you, right? So, uh, I mean, they're all just power upgrades, so if you can do it without it, then why not? Uh, but we have a whole slew of cannons coming. Uh, let's build this bad boy up. That one. Ooh. No! I let him die! I'm the worst! But that's okay. Uh, we want this emitter. Once I get this emitter, I will uh, probably do my upgrades, or probably the emitter and that patch of uh, bad in the back there. That patch of bad is actually not my friend. Uh, so here we go. We are going. It looks like this emitter is stronger than the other emitter that we dealt with, so maybe we did go the right side. <laughs> I literally just took a shot in the dark. And sometimes it works out, because I think the other one was a weaker emitter, but it was generating all the crimson. But because we had that crim decrimsonator, uh, whatever you want to call it, um, we were able to handle it. Uh, let's make sure we get this emitter down. Get down emitter. Build these up. Give it some anti-creep. Give it some juice. Juice, 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 juice. Yeah, that's right. I give it enough anti-creep. Oh, and we're good. And we're good. Oh, and there it is. All of the creep now is ours. Just, it, it seemed like it was so much. And now it seems like it's so little. I mean, even that, you're done, you're done, you're done. Get out of here. I don't want to see your face anymore. And we have anti-creeped the back, which will now, this entire area is ours. We're just going to spray some anti-creep. 
we're gonna hit pause, we're gonna hit four, and see, we have five points! Oh my, sprayer upgrade, uh, fabricator pack. So this, the fabricator, is our gun that builds things, so fantastic. And now, look at this, we now just have aura range, uh, so we can boost our aura range, we can do weapon effect and weapon speed. Um, yeah, projectiles fire fast, faster, don't really care about the projectiles firing faster, I thought it was just rate of fire. So let's just go with two effectivenesses, and I actually want to keep increasing our aura range, so we will do that later. Um, but now, look at how much more, I should have uh, really improved the effectiveness of our weapons earlier. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. But look, we've even taken this whole center without even trying. We weren't even here, and both sides pushing in. Let's see how effective our fabricator is. It's pretty effective. Uh, really built up very, very quickly. Um, and there we have it. Uh, take over the center, take over the world, and get this done. Done, done, done. So, we've taken the sides, we're decreeping, are de-crimsoning uh, just by our existence. Let's take a look at the map now. Um, so we have just this big main area. So we have an upgrade or something over there, an upgrade or something over there, stash over here, an upgrade, the main area over there, and it looks like the super, 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 super uh, crimson generating emitter in the center. So we probably want to take a side and then move towards the front. Now we have skimmers over here, we have some breeder over here, we have ant, we have bad breeder over there. Um, so what side do we want to take? Do we want to go this left side? I think so, because that is both. We also want this corner. Uh, this corner might be better, because it does a fee uh, Actually, this corner's probably better, because it's just, this absorber terrain is safe for us. So let's actually go for that. Uh, let's go for this left side. Let's get this point right here. Oh, it is not a point. Uh, we received the AC Breeder power. It's too powerful to run continuously that you can uh, that you can use zoom map in Q and zoom map out Z to choose between powers and custom five to activate the current basic power. Um, you can only place AC Breeder on terrain that doesn't already have special breeder on it. So if we say clear this off, well, let's clear. Let's, all right, let's clear this off. Uh, and build this guy right here. Uh, it said uh, special button five. Oh, and look at that! We just built that. We literally just pooped that out. Uh, fantastic. I, I'm not gonna complain about just pooping out our own special brand. Oop, wait, let's let's get this built. We I don't care about other things. Two upgrade points. Holy moly! They they're just spoiling us right now. Um, yeah, I, th I think we're pretty, pretty solid. Uh, again, let us pause, hit four, and let's just keep... Oh my gosh, we had four upgrades? Yeah. Yeah, let's look at our gun now. Uh, let's turn it to anti-creeper for a second. Look at that. Our, our anti-creeper destroys the world. Uh, let's check out our mortar. Boom. Oh, my mortar. Oh, mortar. I mean, we can very much just clear off areas. Again, we want to make, we want to get the stash, to be honest with you. Um, but let's focus on cutting out this side again. Uh, we're going to go for the emitter last, because I think that sort of is not imperative. It just makes the most sense that the emitter would be sort of the last boss. Um, so... Yeah, let's let's turn that there. Let's see if we can hit five again. Active power, AC breeder ready. Looks like we did put it down. We pooped out some AC breeder. It's ready in 25 seconds. Uh, oop, I am I am using the build gun to try and destroy creep. That is just silly of me. Uh, ooh, get out of here. Get out of here. We do not want you in our life. It'll be ready in 11 seconds. Fantastic. That is what we want to see. Because we want this area to be breeding for us. It does appear to be a fairly powerful breeder. So if we can pop one down, this should, in theory, 
keep the skimmer factory ours. And again, we're just going to build this up. Boop, 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 boop. No more skimmer factory for them at all. Uh, and as we walk near, again, we have so many powers. We're, 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 just, we're just powerful. Let's try and take the other side now. Uh, because we've taken one side, you know, we want to close it around it. We want the last boss to really feel threatened by our presence. So let's see how this goes. If we just start marching in, uh, let's see. We have guns, we have power, we have the capability, and we can, boom, pop down some breeder right here on this side. Again, we're just, okay, that's what we want. You are what we want. Thank you very much. Give me that AC. It's coming out with force. And yeah, I, th I think we're feeling pretty good. Is Are those explosions happening on the side that I just left? Maybe. Possibly. Probably. Does it matter that much? Nah, it's fine. Oh. Did I, I took some damage, I think. I think I walked into that. Um, uh, that's, that's okay. You know, it was just on my feet. Feet for a second. Uh, no big deal. Uh, why am I shooting down? We have a mortar. And we actually have some upgrade points. This should probably give us two more. That is what I want. Two more upgrade points. Boom, boom. We now have three. Let's get our aura range up again. Oh, and that is uh, the end of that. So there we go. Aura range entirely upgraded. Uh, I like having the aura because, again, it's one of those special bonuses. Uh, hopefully... Oh, no, 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 no. Save. Save the towers. Uh, doesn't quite look like this area can handle itself, unfortunately. So, yeah. Gonna need some help here. Let's make sure you get up there. Uh, do we have... We do have AC Breeder. Let's get another burst down on the ground. Hopefully that's enough, but we want to go for the skimmer. We want to go for the creep that is uh, being generated in that corner. And yeah, this is first person. This is, this is so wild that it's... Again, it, it's a game that you don't really expect to have first person. Uh, it's just so different. Uh, is it better? Eh, it sort of takes the strategy element out of the game. Uh, it's more of, again, it's, it's a first-person shooter. Blah, 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 blah. Yay. Which is neat. Don't get me wrong. But it is not the same game. So I, I am very much a fan of the strategy element of the original game. Uh, so I'm not going to say I prefer this. But I'm also going to say I think it's very amazing that people can, can do this. So, all right. So what do we need? We need to take this, this breeder terrain, uh, I think. Uh, looks like we should be able to. Uh, let's just march ourselves in there, because again, we push back creep. We uh, have the ability to turn the crimson into non-crimson, and we can just flood, flood, flood this with AC. And that way, we can cut out another swath of area that they are using to generate things. And look at... Oh, my, look at that! Oh, blue, blue. <laughs> oh, my... It just melts. Look at it melting. It's so cool. I mean, look at that. Get out of here. Get out of here! Nobody wants you around. Ugh. But... But yes, uh, we're doing pretty good. Ooh, that wall is huge. I, th I let's check the other side. Ha has the other side fallen? Has it been that? Ooh, I am. Oh, this entire area has fallen. Oh my. And this is where we had our creeper breeders. So problematically, so we are falling behind. So it looks like how is this side performing? This side performing significantly better. So it looks like this is the proper side to be on. Uh, I think, you know, as with anything, it does want you to sort of be in certain areas at certain times. But we've gotten all of the uh, all of the upgrades except for that one. So let's start making our way over there. Uh, let's try and destroy some of this. Uh, let's try and save some of that. And again, let's just completely 
decimate everything in our way. Uh, much like the play as creep maps, uh, the Elpex, the one where you just get uh, eggs and things over time, uh, this one you just get upgrades over time, so over time we will just have more and more upgrades. So boom, uh, we don't have it. Eh, eh, I'm a fool. I'm a fool. I was like, boom, I got it because I saw the one, but the one was not the one that I thought it was. It was the one other uh, uh, on the other side. Uh, but we are now cutting off their uh, stash, which is great. Stashes do multiply the creep that is inside of them when they explode. Uh, and I'm actually focusing on the anti-creeper. In fact, let us pop down another bit of creeper anti-creeper breeder right there. And let's start to end this map. Uh, we're basically at the end here. So, so yes. Uh, let's get some, some mortars going. Whatever this is going to give us, you receive the suppressor power. When used, any nearby enemies will be nullified for 20 seconds. Holy moly. Um, there we go. So I believe it was Q to change that. Q, yeah. Uh, oh, I think I changed it, and now I can't change it again. Um... I think I just put the AC breeder. Uh, that's fine. I believe the goal is to suppress. There we go. So our goal is to suppress this for 20 seconds, take over the map. Um, as you can see, it is, it's 150 every 0.17 seconds. That is incredibly, incredibly, incredibly strong. Um, so we probably need that. I thought it was Q. Uh, let, let's see, we do have an upgrade point. So let us spend that, and let us actually check this analog, because it should be there. Uh, I believe it was Q. Uh, but you can use zoom map and Q and zoom map out to choose between powers. Yeah, that's what I thought. Um, Q and... Alright, there we go. Suppressor ready. Let's try and suppress it. Boom. That actually counted as us winning, uh, oddly enough, because we suppressed everything. That doesn't mean that they're done, though, because it only suppresses it for 20 seconds. So we need to make sure we nullify this within that 20 second period. So we need to find the nullifier and build that up to be sure. See? Uh, okay, we got it. It's built. Let's go. Okay. Whew. Whew, we made it. I think. And the nullifier survived. Oh, we just built that in time. Let's eliminate this creep. It has been done, so say we all, we all being the founders, that is us. A little bit down there, but I think we're powerful enough to just overwhelm that in entirely. Done and done. Looks like the world is ours. Uh, let's turn off auto fire. Let's take a look at the map. Boom, you can see all of the energy everything going we have taken the world this has been a first person creeper map very very cool we've achieved everything again probably in too long of a time but again we we're just chilling having fun 60 minutes 17 minutes a lot around the 30 minute mark um so could have been faster for sure but just having fun this was this was quite enjoyable so thank you very much uh i hope you enjoyed Please uh, leave a like, comment, share, subscribe, you know, all, lo all those good things, you know, I gotta say, it's kind of mandated. It does help me, I do feel uh, the inspiration to keep going when I do see, see that for sure, so thank you very much. And, yeah, I hope you enjoyed. Uh, I don't know about the next Creeper video, it'll probably be a Chronon, because I am trying to sprinkle those in, those are random and daily, so... You know, I do want to see those as well. I don't want to necessarily do another another auto. We will do that again. I do love the packs. Maybe we'll do a regular pack, not a light or anything like that. One where we can uh, control the, queep, the creep. Wow, the creep. Um, some, maybe the fortress. That sounds pretty good. It's highly rated. Pack assault. Uh, that sounds pretty good as well. Uh, I don't know. So it doesn't look like it's a light pack. So that could be quite fun. 
Uh, so we will see. Uh, a whole, there's a lot of first-person shooters. Cascades looks good. There are tons of maps to do, and we will get to them. All things in time. But thank you so much. I hope you enjoyed, and have a wonderful day.